Now we're going to switch over to high school baseball talk. The Rudyard Bulldogs are once again making a push to head downstate for the Final Four. However, their season got off to a bit of a slow start, losing their first four games. So, Coach Mitchell, how was the team able to rally after the slow start? Just with the experience that they've had in other sports, the success they've had, they um, they're able to adapt to it, and they just I mean they're they're an even keel, just go with the flow type of group. They don't get too high, they don't get too low. Um, I was just joking around with somebody yesterday about how was it last season when they made it to the Final Four for basketball? We were in the locker room after the game, and they're all just stone cold quiet. And one of the assistant coaches, Tracy Peterson, says, you guys realize you just made it to the Final Four, right? And they're all kind of looking at each other like, oh, yeah, big deal, you know. But that they're just an even keel kind of group, and they realize it's the end of the season that matters and not the start. Well, you have certainly churned the season around, winning eight games in a row. What about this team makes it special and stands out amongst the great history of Rudyard baseball? About a few years ago, they started calling themselves the rats. And that's our big thing, feed the rats. You know, we got to feed the rats. We got to get here at 6 o'clock, feed the rats. We got to go to the field, feed the rats. And just that mantra, that mentality has carried over from football to basketball and now to baseball. And it's just something they enjoy. I mean, it's not something you have to force them to do. So, Coach, what do you think gives this team an edge to make it downstate for a chance to bring another baseball title back home to Rudyard? We're around each other year-round. Like, when we lift before practice, like, I'm with them in football season lifting with them. I'm with them during basketball season lifting with them. I'm on the road with them. Like, we're just one team, and when the next season starts, they just change jerseys and keep going. Thank you for watching ABC 10 News on YouTube. For the latest Upper Peninsula news, weather, and sports, be sure to subscribe to our channel and like us on our Facebook page.